What's up everybody, Kwame here, back again with another video, and today I am looking at two products from Creative Lab. So they were kind enough to send me out this products. Full disclosure, whatever I'm about to say here is my opinion, even though they sent this to me for free to test out. They are not paying me, or do they have any say over what I think of these products? Uh, let's take a look at the boxes here. So really... Um, just plain boxes, which is fine by me. You have the headphones, which are the Creative Lab, the Creative Outlier in black. And then you have the Creative Metal Plus, which is their little Bluetooth speaker. Uh, in the box on the, um, let's see if I can get it to focus here. On the headphones, you get the headphones, a pouch, charging cable, and um, 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. And then on the the box here, you get uh, just a charging cable. You don't get a block or anything, so you just get the micro USB cord. So the prices on these, the headphones are $59.99, $60, and then the speaker is normally $49.99, but right now they are giving you $10 off, so it's $39.99. Let me start with the headphones first. So this is the pouch that you get, a uh, little pouch. Sorry, mine is pretty dirty. Picks, it's, it's like a felt pouch, so it does pick up lint and everything, as you can see here, very easily. Uh, the headphones themselves are plastic, cheaper type of foam here. Uh, I left this on here uh, for a reason, but I will, I'll put it back on. I took it out, put it back on, and I will tell you why in a minute. Our on-ear headphones, they will go over the ear. Like, my wife put them on. She's like, oh, they go over my ear. She has small ears, so it just depends on your ear size, but these do sit on my ear. The headband is also plastic. I will say, even though everything is plastic, it is built pretty sturdy, so there isn't a lot of noise, if you listen. Like, there's not a lot of creaking or anything like that, uh, so that is pretty nice. The sound on these are pretty good. Uh, they are Bluetooth, so they're wireless, they're head wireless headphones. They're not, you know, your top of the line Beats or Bose or any of the other headphones that I reviewed on the channel. You have a little subtle creative here. You know, if you're looking at it as a side, you don't really see it. Right on the top, you do see it. It's big, but it is subtle in there, so it doesn't scream out or anything like that. The headband is, I, I really like this headband. I'm not gonna lie. I wish more manufacturers used a headband like this. You can see the stitching. Stitching is really Nicely done. And the headband just feels really solid. Like That is the one thing that I was really surprised about is that they feel great. And the other amazing thing is I barely have to adjust these to put them over my head. Now, as I said before, I have a bigger head. So I usually have to either adjust everything to the max or you know, adjust a little bit. But these adjust quite a bit. But just out of the box, I moved them here. That's all I needed to do to get them on my head. And they felt very comfortable, felt fine. Um, they sat on the ear perfectly fine. Like, I didn't have any problem with them. The sound was good. It wasn't anything breathtaking. It's not a ton of bass on these. But if you're a gamer, like, and this is what Creative Labs is known for, is making, like, sound cards, things like that, and you're using these, you know, on your computer and you just want something to buy for your kids, these would be a pretty good uh, choice to make. Now, the reason why I kept the plastic on here so that you can see, you know, you have your play, pause, volume up, volume down, forward, back, which is nice. I like that they separated the volume up and volume down and forward and back on here. Uh, you do press and hold to connect your Bluetooth device, but once you take this part off, there are no controls. So you have to remember, uh, you know, what the controls are just from repeating, like doing them over and over again. It was fine, like, there, since there's nothing on this side, except for a little branding, you know, it's pretty easy to remember play pause. Like, you just hit this, play pause, and power. Uh, you know, every now and again, I would get confused on to which was volume up, volume down, but, I mean, it happened a couple times when I first got them. Now, it's second nature. I can just volume up, volume down, forward, back. Like, it's no big deal. Uh, and you just have to remember it's on your right side. Same as the auxiliary in and your um, micro USB charging port. I do wish everything had USB-C now. It'd be nice so you don't have to carry two cords around with you. But 
it is what it is. $50, $60 pair of headphones. It's solid. I don't know if they're worth $60, to be honest. I've been using them to edit videos, uh, like just throw them in my bag, edit my videos on here. It's a good pair of headphones if you don't worry about them getting lost, getting broken. I don't think they'll break in your bag. I mean, they're really solid. Even though they're plastic, they're really solid and they do fold up a little bit so you can get them down. You can put them in the bag. I haven't been using the bag. I've just thrown them in my backpack and you can see there's no scuffs, there's no marks after a month of using them. So. I think that's really good. Now, the other one that I'm really excited about is the Metal X Plus, that's how you say it. I really like this speaker. It is all metal, so as the name says, you have a metal grill on the front, metal on the top, metal on the back, and then the bottom here you have um, the little plastic feet, and then this part is plastic or rubber. Now, underneath this little flap here, you have your auxiliary port and your charging again i wish it was usb 3 but it is what it is and it does have um gaskets here so protect them if it gets wet i don't know if this is waterproof or not uh so don't like take it in like the water but you could use it in your bathroom perfectly fine i've been using it there again for the last month perfectly fine it does have your power button and then a Bluetooth pairing button. So normally the power button is the same as the pairing button, but here they split that out, play pause, and then your volume up, volume down, and then these do double as forward and back. Uh, the This Bluetooth button also works to activate your assistant on your phone on, or on your tablet. So if you press and hold it, if you just press it, if you press and hold, it will go into pairing mode. If you just press it, it turns on the assistant. It is pretty cool if you want to ask a question or something like that, you just have to tap the button there and you're good to go. The sound is very good on here. For $40, I'm pretty much blown away by the sound. I wasn't expecting much after, I used the headphones first and they were good, but they weren't anything to write home about. But the sound on here is really, really good. You don't get a ton of bass, but just overall sound quality, I really like this uh, speaker. This is a perfect like travel speaker. Throw it in your bag if you're going on vacation, if you're going camping. Um, I brought this. We went on a family vacation. I brought this in my bag. It is a little heavy, so I would put it on. Uh, like if you, I wouldn't put it in your backpack, but if you do have a carry on that's uh, like a larger carry on, I would put it in there and then throw it in the bin up above you. But yeah, this is a really really nice speaker. I really, really highly recommend the speaker. Thank you everyone for watching this video. I do have more videos coming up for you. So hold, uh, hold tight, stay tuned, whatever. Again, thank you as always for watching these videos. Thank you for all the new subscribers I've had in the last month, even though I haven't been putting up too many videos. That is about to change. I'm gonna start recording more videos on a certain day of the week and then uploading them throughout the week. As always, thank you for your time and I will see you in the next video. Have a good one, bye bye.